Hi, I'm Andrew Whitmer, the creator of Enlarge. Enlarge is a new app that lets you use your iPhone, iPod Touch and iPad as a predictive exposure computer for your traditional darkroom enlarger. It lets you compute the exposure time needed to expose a print of any size once you know the exposure time needed to expose a print of any one size. This means that when you enlarge with enlarge, you can make all your test and work prints at conveniently small sizes as whole small enlargements like this one. And then use enlarge to compute the exposure time needed to expose any perfectly matching larger enlargements like this one. Now, in order to make these exposure predictions, enlarge first needs to be calibrated to your enlarger a process in which you need to make a pair of matching test strips, one made at a low magnification and the other at a high magnification. Now, if your lamp house is not correctly set up to give you a reasonably even illumination across the entire negative carrier field, then you'll find it difficult to make these two test strips so that the tones all match up in the same print. This is because the low magnification print will be artificially darker or lighter in some areas due to the uneven illumination, whilst the high magnification print which uses only the most central part of the field will be relatively even. How do you know whether your uh, negative carrier is evenly illuminated? And if it isn't, how can you fix it? The best and simplest test is to simply print a small, medium tone print of the empty negative carrier field, like this one. Make sure you use an enlarging lens that would normally be used to cover the format that you're testing. For example, here I would use a 100mm lens to test the illumination of this 6x9cm negative carrier. When you make this small print, focus the lens first using a test negative and use an aperture that you would normally use when enlarging, such as f8 or f11. The exact tone of grey that you produce in the print and the exposure time used to make it are not important. Any medium tone of grey will do. This small print will show you at a glance how even or uneven your negative carrier illumination is. By the way, if you've got any old photo paper lying about that's gone off or fogged due to uh, heat exposure or excessive age, you should find it's quite good enough to do this job, in which case it's a good use for it. situation one of the screws all the way out a bit of movement there 